Hi there, this is John Alexo from Pro Sectorials, and today I'm going to talk about the Kindle free promotion, the five day free promotion that you can get for your books when you enroll into their program. And I'm going to share with you my opinion about this because I know that this is something that a lot of people out there worry about getting more free downloads for their book, as it was a, a huge deal when it comes to Kindle publishing. So I'm going to share with you my opinion about this and also I'm going to share with you uh, several tips to help you get more free downloads for your new books. Okay, so this is a book that I published recently. It has about uh, 10 to 12 days, something like that. And it has already went through the, the process, the, the paid process where I set my book at 099 to get reviews for my book and during this process the first process I actually got a couple of organic sales over here and that is always good it means that uh, people are actually looking for this title or this this keyword inside of Amazon and it's something that is actually profitable if I get to um, to put this book in the front page of results especially on the the first five top results and then you can see over here this is the um, the five day free promotion that I did for this book and it got it didn't got exactly 1000 downloads but it got nearly 1000 downloads uh, for free during the, the five day period and that is quite a decent number of free downloads for a book it means that it first means that there's interest in this topic uh, the topic of this book so yeah, I know that it's something that people are actually finding inside of Amazon and I know that because before I actually got this book uh, written by my ghostwriters I went uh, to Amazon and I searched for keywords that were profitable so I knew before I even published this book I already knew that this was a keyword or a title that was actually profitable inside of Amazon. So nothing was actually done recklessly. Anyway, I'm talking about the free promotion. So I got a decent number of free downloads over here. Now, a lot of people stress about the, the free promotion as it was a huge deal. In my opinion, I think the free promotion, um, it's something that really sucks. I don't like the free promotion. Honestly, I really don't like the free promotion. I don't see any kind of advantages when your book goes on free because the thing I, I see, I think that the idea that Amazon had initially when it com came to the free promotion was once you launch a new book, you would set the, the five day free promotion and you would get a, a lot of free downloads for your book and people would leave organic reviews. So it was a way for for in a way for to help you get organic reviews for your books but in my experience from nearly 1000 uh, 1000 downloads i didn't notice or i don't think anyone left the organic review so it's something that really doesn't help you to get more organic reviews in my experience the other thing i don't like about the free promotion is i mean nearly 1000 downloads happen over here that means that I potentially lost 1,000 possible people who would actually possibly purchase my book in if it was at a regular pricing so you immediately lose a bunch of possible customers because these people get your book for free of course later on they aren't going to get your book once it has its normal pricing so you immediately lose a lot of sales because of the free promotion and that is something that I don't like and the other thing is I really don't see any kind of correlation when it comes to the rankings that you get afterwards I mean even though I, I got nearly 1000 downloads I don't see any kind of impact on the rankings that I have afterwards after the the five day free promotion actually my my book was ranking in the front page of results before the free promotion and after the free promotion my book went to the second page of results for the keyword that I'm targeting so it actually lost ranking when it comes to 
to the free promotion. So I don't see any kind of advantage when it comes to the rankings. I don't see uh, the free promotion. I really don't see any kind of effect when it comes to improving your paid in Kindle store rankings or and also ranking your book better inside of the listing or the keyword that you're trying to target. So I don't see any kind of advantages when it comes to that. And honestly, I think the free promotion is something that sucks. It probably was a good idea, but people really rarely leave any kind of organic reviews. Most people who get your book during the free promotion or people, of course, some people are interested on your book. They, they would get your book probably if it was set on the number normal pricing. But of course, if they can get it for free, then even better. But a lot of people do what I call uh, cover collection. So basically, they just get a book just to, to have a good looking cover inside of their Kindle platform. And a lot of people don't really read your book. That the people who get your book for free, a lot of them really don't read your book. And you can see that by the number of pages that have been read from this book. I mean, you can see that, and this is a short book, it's not a, a huge book, but you can see, I mean, with 1,000 downloads, you would expect that you would get a lot more pages read inside of Kindle for this specific book. And you can see that it's not a huge thing. So a lot of people get this book for free. Of course, some people would be your customers otherwise, but if they can get it for free, then even better. But a lot of people do what I call the, the cover collection. They just get your book. They have a nice looking cover inside of their Kindle platform and they never really read the content inside of your book. So there's really not much advantages when it comes to the free promotion, in my opinion, of course. Now, the only reason why I do the five day free promotion, probably are wondering at this point, of course, is because I can get free reviews for my books. I already said many times that I do the review swapping process. I still consider this one of the easiest ways for you to get reviews for your books. And that is the only reason why I do the five day free promotion, because I can get a good number of free reviews for my books, because otherwise, I would need to pay for my reviews if it was at its uh, regular pricing or at 0 0.99. So this is the only reason why I do the free promotion. It's to get free reviews for my books because I don't see any kind of advantages advantage. Otherwise, I would, if I, I if I could, I would actually just leave the book at the regular pricing. At least I would get some sales for my book, and the free promotion really takes away uh, some potential customers that you would get and so on. So I wouldn't worry much about the free promotion in the, I wouldn't worry. Um, it really doesn't have much effect on the, on your rankings for that book. As I already said, I even lost rankings with this free promotion. Anyway, let's talk about a few tips that you can apply so you can get more free downloads. So the first thing is really keywords. Okay, keywords is everything when it comes to Kindle publishing. You need to choose the right keywords for your books. You need to choose profitable keywords for your books before you even get the, the ghost writers for your, your book, someone to write your book, or even if you write your own books. Keywords is everything. Having a keyword that is profitable for your book is everything. That is really important because if you have a, a good queue or something that people are searching inside of Amazon, then of course you will get more people interested on your book. And then once, once it goes on the free promotion, you will get more downloads. So that is the most important thing. And the other thing is the cover of your book. I do high quality covers for my books. I really go on the details of my cover. I try to do them really, really good and high quality covers. And when it comes to this, you can hire someone in Fiverr to do your covers if you want, if you don't have much skill with an image editing software such as Photoshop, which is the software that I actually do use to do my covers. And I personally do my own covers. I don't, I mean, I of course I could pay someone $5, $10, or a bit more to get the cover done, 
But if I know how to use Photoshop and I'm skilled with that software because I've been using it for many, many years and I, I basically do most of my, my channel art and everything with Photoshop. So if I know how to do really good covers, I prefer to do them than having someone else to do my, my covers because I know if I pay $5, $10, they certainly won't go so much in detail with the covers as I, I will because of course I want to sell my book as best as possible. So having a high quality cover is extremely important. And those are the two things that are really important. The other thing is little tricks that you can implement before your book goes on the free promotion. One thing I make sure to, to have before I set the five day free promotion is to have at least one review on my book because that gives, uh, I mean, once my book goes on the free promotion and people see that it has one review, it gives them, I mean, it, it entices people to get that book more because if they saw no reviews, they immediately assume that that book doesn't have much quality because it doesn't have any kind of reviews. So I always make sure that I have at least one review before my book goes on the free promotion. So that is another aspect. The other one that um, I also do before it goes on the free promotion is my, my the pricing of my book initially is at 0 0.99. And before it goes uh, in the free promotion, I always set my book at 2.99. So what happens is people see when once it goes on the free promotion, they see the the standard pricing, which is at 2.99. So there's a bigger contrast in pricing, and that makes people look at the book and consider it more valuable, and that increases the number of downloads that I get for my book. Of course, all of the rest is important, the content that you have inside of your book, but as you can see, uh, most people who get your book uh, during the free promotion, they really don't read the content inside of your book. Uh, but sure, of course, you always need to have high quality content in inside of your book. That is extremely important uh, because you don't want to, I mean, if you don't, I mean, if people don't leave any kind of reviews, you, if most people will leave reviews when the content is bad and that is the kind of reviews that you don't want to, to have. So if you have good quality content, people don't leave reviews, but at least you don't get negative reviews. And that is the biggest reason why you want to have high quality content. So those are the, the few aspects when it comes to, to getting more free downloads. Now, something that you probably have noticed is I didn't mention anything about promoting my books inside of Facebook, inside of Twitter, going to those uh, uh, fishy websites, submission websites where you publish your book and you schedule it for them to promote inside of their own website. Once your book goes under free promotion, I didn't do anything like that, okay? That is something that I did in the past initially when I published my first books. I used to do that. And honestly, those books would get uh, far less uh, downloads than this book I got over here. And I didn't do anything like that for this book. Basically, I did exactly what I mentioned before. It's keywords, having a good cover, and also um, having a good cover, doing that pricing strategy, which I mentioned, and also having a review or two before your book goes on the free promotion. So those are the tricks that you should implement if you want to get more free downloads. But honestly, as I already said before, I don't think that, uh, I really don't consider the free promotion a, a huge deal. It's not something that I consider that important because it doesn't seem to have any kind of impact when it comes to improving the rankings for my books for the keyword that I'm trying to, to, to target. Anyway, this is all for this video. If you want to make more money with your Kindle publishing business when it comes to nonfiction books, I recommend for you to get one of the best video courses out there called Self Publisher Revolution. This is exactly the video course that I got where I learned most of what I know nowadays about Kindle publishing. That is all for this video. Leave a like or subscribe to my YouTube channel if you still haven't done it until this point so you can receive my weekly video updates where I share with you plenty of tips related to Kindle publishing, online marketing, and a lot more. Stay there, stay tuned with Pro Tutorials, and bye.